Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Inversion deck from Paul Harris. Uh, what is the Inversion deck? Basically, it's an inside out deck. Uh, it is a box that looks like a deck and a deck that looks like a box. Huh? Exactly. That's what this is. It's an inversion deck. Uh, the deck, uh, I got mine from PigwinMagic.com. Uh, and I've never seen anything on the box that actually says that it is from Paul Harris. I heard that he designed it. Uh, so, kind of like other Paul Harris things, it's just kind of like another addition of weirdness or astonishment that uh, you could add to something. I don't know that it's meant specifically for a trick, uh, I did some research out there, I tried to find if uh, anybody was using this in a magic trick or knew of something that maybe it was tied to. Didn't see anything out there. Um, so it is what it is. Uh, the tuck box looks like a deck of cards. Uh, the front of the tuck case looks like the back of a deck of Riderback 808s. Uh, the sides actually have a grayed out lines so that it looks like a stack of cards, as does the top, as does the bottom. Uh, but it's kind of given away by the little folds there. Um, the back of the tuck case is the standard King of Hearts. And you have a regular tuck flap with nothing on it and no tuck seal. And that is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. So if the box looks like the cards, then the cards, look like the box. <laughs> so uh, this is what the deck looks like. And as you can see, it kind of resembles a card box if I hold it completely right, although there's no writing on the sides. Um, so what you're getting with this is you're getting an entire deck of cards that are the face of a standard deck of Riderback 808. So every single card is the face of a deck, okay? That's what you're getting. Now the faces, they're all just gonna be standard uh, US PCC playing cards. Standard PIF, standard courts, standard uh, layout. Everything's gonna be standard, standard, standard. Uh, with this deck, you're gonna get a couple of extras. You're gonna get two full-size black and white jokers with standard bicycle backs, okay? So standard, standard jokers. Uh, you're gonna get a blank card that has a deck face on the other side, and you're gonna get a deck face card that has a standard USPCC back. Everything else, like I said, is the back design of the front design of the tuck case, and the faces are completely standard. Uh, so if that looks like something that you'd be interested in, if that looks like something fun, uh, probably I would recommend this to people uh, that just collect playing cards that like something uh, interesting. RV Magic that has a lot of humor to it, I think uh, that would be a neat shocker for your spectators to see this, you know, deck go in. Maybe you could do it in a change bag, I don't know, like, you know, a real deck goes in and a, you inverted it, it went into a black hole and this inversion deck came out, I don't know, you could probably come up with a bunch of things. Um, I know that I have many gaff decks that come with these cards that is to resemble the, the face of a deck of cards. And so this would, if you use this gaff, then getting the inversion deck would give you 52 of those gaffs, depending on what you use it for. So that's always an option as well. Like I said, I got mine at penguinmagic.com. All right, so that is it for this deck review of the inversion deck from Paul Harris. As always, we recommend that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. Now, if you wanna follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magic orthodoxy, twitter.com slash magic orthodoxy, and instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. Thanks, bye.